We're here in Quebec City uh, for the GP Cyclist Quebec, talking with Cody Canning, Canadian National Sprint Challenge Champion, and now the Sprint Challenge Champion for um, the uh, Quebec Grand Prix. So, Cody, um, I mean, you, you won the national championships, which gave you the right to come to this race. Did you really expect that you'd be able to, uh, to, do, the, to do the same and win here? Uh, I, I had no idea what I'd actually be able to do here. Um, I ended up doing well at the national championships and just it's a little bit of a tactical game out there. Um, I like to kind of just try and control the race um, and try and play it into, into my advantage. And I, I had a little bit of practice at our nationals with how to position myself for the sprints and when to go and when to time it and how to go, um, what gear to pick. So the nationals challenge sprint helped me. Um, and I know like it's, it's an event that these guys don't, train specifically for these guys train for the road races and I mean I do as well but it, it's an event where you know everyone's sort of on the same playing field and that they do it once or twice a year and it's it's sort of a, a different event and so I, I thought I had as good of odds as anyone just because it is an event that's sort of it's not guys training year-round just for the sprint challenge um, and I felt like I had a good uh, good nationals to sort of prepare myself for it tactically and you know how to do it so I don't know, I thought I had a fair chance. <laughs> now, your tactic, I mean, you seem to go to the front um, for every sprint after, after the turn. Well, I mean, was, 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 was that your tactic, to try and lead from the front? Yeah, I don't, I don't think you waste any energy starting from the front because it's, it's not very fast. Everyone's sort of track sprinting. So from the front, I find it's actually you're not really pushing any more wind than you are in the back off the start. And at least that way, when, when you jump, you jump with a bit of a gap. Uh, you're, you start with a bike length ahead. Um, and so, yeah, I, I like to lead. I like to control it. So, you know, when when I jump, if I jump first, that means I start the sprint. And I can sort of speed it up as I think guys are getting antsy. If I want to wait longer or if I think it's a good time to go, you just go. So you can kind of control guys as far as how long to leave the sprint. Um, and then you're never boxed in. So, um, yeah, it's just if you feel like you have the acceleration, there's no excuses from the front. Now, the final, um, there were two Canadians in there, you and Elliot, um, and it looked like uh, you, you attacked and then Elliot sort of hung back a bit. Was that something you sort of discussed to, to get that gap? No, all, all the Canadians were, I, I think, for the most part, riding for themselves. Um, Elliot, you know, had a chance to, to, win, to win the race as well, and I think everyone just has to play uh, whatever they think is going to work best, whether that's coming from behind. We had quite a big headwind, so... I kept getting told not to start from the front, stop going from the front, but I feel more confident from there. Um, I feel when I jump, I, I can get enough of a gap that the guys behind aren't really getting a ton of benefit from me. I just get nice and low and try and get a bit of a gap. So, yeah, and Elliot and I weren't, weren't working together, but it's too bad that, you know, he wasn't there in a bit better position, but it's fine, yeah. So I guess a um, pretty good way to end the season. Yeah, the end of my season, so I'm happy with the win. It's always nice to, to end on a high note instead of, you know, um, best way I could have ended it. Um, a little bit of a low note in Alberta. I, I kind of got sick and got, you know, shelled in Lethbridge in the rain and just wasn't feeling it with a head cold and it was a hard day out there. So a little bit of a letdown at Tour of Alberta in that I wasn't able to finish, wasn't able to ride in my hometown of Edmonton. So it was nice to come here and, and win the last race of the year. Well, congratulations. Thank you very much.